Today, we begin our second week of virtual instruction and telework, and I'm grateful to our entire community for a smooth transition to this new environment. I know it hasn't been easy for any of you, and I'm proud of how our students, faculty, and staff have come together to make this work. I've seen so many examples of our Jesuit values in action. Our professors with experience in teaching online have offered workshops and invited their colleagues into their classes so that we can all use technology to create the best possible learning experience for our students. Our staff are working round the clock to creatively find ways to keep our community connected through virtual town halls, endless Zoom sessions, online admissions, and remote career counseling. Our students have been amazingly understanding and flexible with us and with each other. And so together, we continue to deliver on our educational mission while ensuring the health and safety of our community. And even in challenging times, there are silver linings. There's so many Hoyas striving to serve the common good, even in a virtual world. For instance, alumni have been donating airline miles to help make sure all of our students get home. Students themselves have been reaching out to one another to ensure that everyone has access to food and necessities. And a team of MBS students who were scheduled to volunteer at the Capital Area Food Bank next month turned their efforts to a fundraising drive, collecting $1,600 in donations to provide 4,000 meals for those in need. Because of all of you, I've never been prouder to be a part of Georgetown McDonough. I will continue to stay in touch and please do send us your feedback. Let's continue to push forward together, looking out for those in our school community, in our own families and in our neighborhood. We will continue to move forward as one McDonough. Thank you.